Hey guys, it's me, Tiffany. And Chris. With the TC and G fam. We are back with another mukbang, but not just any mukbang. It is a snacks mukbang. So we have like six different types of chips here. We've got sour cream and onion right here. We've got Cool Ranch Doritos here, Funyuns here, Cheetos here, Cheese Doritos here, and then we've got Fritos here. So that is what we got. And of course I've got my core water. And then we've got a chicken sandwich that we got from Chick-fil-A to go with it. Got my mayonnaise here, a little bit of ketchup here, and I got some hot sauce there, some Frank's Red Hot, and then of course I've got some French onion dip to go with some of these chips if you want to dip them so with further ado let's get started because right. i'm starving i gotta put some mayonnaise on mine how is everybody doing today mm, mm. it has been one rainy rainy day today for those of you who don't live here in ohio it has rained literally all day long, literally, um, here in Ohio, in Youngstown, where I'm from. So, I mean, it's just, it has not stopped at all. Get a good look at that. Chicken sandwich with the little pickles in there. All right. Mmm. So good. Mm -mm -mm. We have not done a mukbang in a while. Things have been pretty crazy. As many of you probably don't know, I manage my Oldest daughter, Gabriella's softball team, 13 to 17 year old girls. And yeah, that's a lot of fun. But um, signups has started and so has practices. So with all that going on and everything else, it's been pretty busy. He's been working a lot, so he's got not one, but two jobs, so in between that and everything else going on, literally. <clears throat> Mm. So good. Chick fil A. They've got the best chicken sandwiches. I don't care what it is. Has the says. best chicken they sandwiches best chicken ever. Sandwiches. And literally, I could eat those every day. That is my favorite by far fast food restaurant that there is out. Mm. That cold water really hits the spot. Mm. So many different snacks here. 
Maybe I'll give you guys a close up. A little better look. Sour cream, Fritos, Doritos, Cool Ranch, Funyuns, and Cheetos. Yeah, yeah. Really good, guys. Really good. <clears throat> What is your favorite snack when you have a snack? If you eat potato chips or Funyuns or whatever, what is your favorite? Tell us in the comments below. Me, out of everything I share, I think I like the Fritos best. Fritos, Fritos are usually my favorite. I like Cheetos too. They're not bad. Mm -hmm. Make sure you guys like oven baked our video. Are those the oven baked? No. Just regular. Make sure you like our video. Subscribe. Share, share, share. Sharing means caring. Every time you share our video, it gets us one step closer to being monetized. And as soon as that happens, we can start making more videos. We also have a Facebook page, and that's Tiffany, Christopher, and Gabriella on Facebook. So check us out. There's some stuff we post on there that we don't post on YouTube. Just because it's like some pictures or something like that. Um, because in between doing mukbangs, like if I cook something and I just want to share it with you guys, I just post the pictures on there. So yeah, check us out. We look forward to hearing comments. On Facebook from you. too. Yeah. On Facebook. Let us know what you want us to try. We're always up for new ideas. I think we've done Burger King, Taco Bell so far. And then we started doing home cooked meals because Honestly, like, it's fun to do fast food, but we enjoy doing home-cooked meals more. Obviously, when you have a family, you're home cooking a lot more, so it makes it easier to do more mukbangs when you're doing it with home-cooked meals. Um, I know a lot of mukbangers may not have kids. So, like, for them to eat out, it's probably easier. More easier for them. And, um, like, for them to eat out is, like, really easy for them. But, you know, we have two girls, 14 and 4. And so, I cook, obviously, every day. So, it's easier if we mukbang with whatever I'm making for dinner. And then we'll do like some fast food places in between also, but. I just don't want like us to eat fast food and then I still have to cook for the kids, you know what I mean? And I just don't want the kids eating fast food every day too. We don't want to eat fast food every day either, so. It works out better. <clears throat> That's really good. <laughs> By the way, guys, if you take a cheese Dorito and you dip it into French onion dip, mm, that's really good.
So good. Mmm. Almost lost my pickle. Hey, what happens? <laughs> <laughs> I won't even say anything. <laughs> but anyway. I am stuffed. <laughs> Guys, I did eat lunch today, so... That's probably why I'm so cool. Plus, we were on our way home, and there was this, like, food truck. It was in a parking lot somewhere. And, um, legit, we wanted to see what they had. And they had, like, a lot of stuff, right? Like, yeah. a lot of stuff. The, from burgers to lamb burgers to, it just, like, everything. So we got a gyro from them. And we split it. Well, I like took a couple bites and he ate it. But I didn't really care for it, to be honest. It wasn't real lamb meat. Obviously, I'm Greek. So, like, if I'm going to eat a gyro, I want the real lamb meat off the cone. Like, shaved off the cone. Um, the fake stuff is good, too. Sometimes it just depends on how they make it. But um, this particular gyro... <laughs> It was not that great. Um, I don't even know what they were called. What were they called? I don't remember. Alternative? I think. Something alternative. Anyways. And um, I guess they have like a website and everything. And uh, yeah, they just weren't very good at all whatsoever. The gyro was like not good. And then they have siki sauce on top of it which is kind of like a cucumber sauce, um, you know, that you put on gyros. And um, it didn't really <clears throat> It wasn't a homemade Zeke like sauce. It was Zeke a store-bought. Um, yeah, I don't know what if they made it or if they bought it or what they do, but it definitely made the entire sandwich, like, I think that's what the taste was on there that I wasn't digging. But, um, like, honestly, if that sauce wasn't on it, it probably would have tasted a lot better. That sauce really made it, like, gross. Um, yeah, I don't know. If they would have did something else with the sauce, it, it might have been good. But, yeah, we just tried it out. And it was, like, eight fifty. It was eight fifty for a gyro, and it was not good. So that was a waste. But um, we just wanted to try it, and so like I took like a couple of bites, and I was like, "You can have it." Which is fine with me, cause <laughs> he doesn't care, cause he'll eat anything. We always say, no matter what. Um, like our team, we work out perfectly because whatever I don't eat. I get to eat. He'll, he'll have it. <laughs> um, <laughs> he pretty much likes everything, most everything. I wouldn't say there's too much stuff that he's picky about. You pretty much eat everything. Um, Big on most things. Some of the, a lot of stuff, seafood, I don't really eat a lot of seafood. Yeah, if it was like seafood, he probably wouldn't. I mean, you do like shrimp, I like but... Fresh, I like fresh seafood. I like the stomach He likes shrimp and like fish. But, like, not, like, a bunch of other stuff. But, yeah. Well, hey, guys. I'm glad you could join us for our little snack buffet and our uh, Chick-fil-A sandwiches. Unfortunately, I can't finish mine. But um, catch us back here um, tomorrow on another mukbang. And we will be doing a BLT mukbang. So, see you later. later. Bye. Bye.